So Black Galaxy, uh, they've gotten their official first win in the ongoing champ tournament in uh, Algeria. It was emphatic win, convincing win, even though they went down by that's a, a, a goal before they were able to do complete comeback and they score uh, Sudan. Okay, uh, three goals to one. Now the debate on social media is that is it that Ghana Premier League is uh, better than? the Sudanese uh, Premier League, <laughs> that's what is going on social media. People are just talking about it. Uh, some are sharing the ideas, others are saying that no, uh, Sudanese League is better than Ghana, but just that Ghana uh, were able to beat them because they took their chances and they were a uh, formidable side against them. And uh, some are also saying that, yeah, uh, this is a chance for local players. And uh, if uh, your local team, uh, that's a local league is good, uh, you are able to show say yes you win the tournament and we will beat those small 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 teams and so that is but I, i'll be telling the ratings okay so we'll be comparing the ratings uh from the black galaxies and also the ones of the the sudanese team so i'll be telling you about the the, the ratings and uh kovikoji yet the kovikoji trended number one on twitter because of his performance uh during the game and a free bunny also received a Red card, and also one of the revelations in the game. Very fantastic player. As something was called right back, that's all guessing. Japan was also on form. Very fantastic uh, game. I will be telling you more from this story, and I'll be giving you the ratings and tell you many other stories that you need to know concerning Black Star players and also Ghanaian players and what is going on in the channel. Tournament. This is a uh, bit nifty. My name is Tim Rumain Kofi. I think I think on guys don't forget to subscribe to the channel and also hit the notification bell or share the video to your friends like and also your comment please kindly subscribe to the channel for me I beg I take God but now let's talk about the the ratings okay let's see how the players perform against Sudan and how the Sudanese players also uh, perform with the victory you know the black guys now maintain their chance of qualifying to the next stage of the competition okay so because uh, morocco did not come down the black guys are having uh, six points and now they have scored four goals in the competition and they have uh conceded three goals so they have one goal advantage so the next uh round that's my sudan who play against madagascar then you know what to go on but uh, as it stands now ghana will be uh, hoping to qualify i mean i believe they, they've qualified but there's no way that sudan will beat madagascar more than five goals and even they beat madagascar five goals still ghana will qualify okay so you know uh kunadi adam fa banya and also suraj said well secure black stars come back green over uh sudan after noon mohammed shot the uh, east africa in the league in the first half you know 10 men ghana managed to get their win over uh, that's their chaotic lineup is against that Sudanese side. Hey, Sudan for a more year, but yeah, for more thing wrong. And they were very, very good uh, at the first half and the second half. They came in stronger. Okay, so let me start the ratings. Let me start from the goalkeeper. You know, Danlad Ibrahim was rated eight. Uh, Danlad Ibrahim was superb uh, in the goal. He made two crucial saves that secure the victory. For Ghana, that one-on-one -on -one power that but he was able to uh, save that ball it was a phenomenal, very fantastic, uh, you no know, performance. And also another player that did very, very is Augustin a Japan of Asante Kotoko. He played 90 minutes of soccer fiesta. 90 minutes. Oh, jump four. No, Japan had a decent performance, uh, an impactful one, and uh, Charlie just going uh, front, crossing the balls into the dangerous areas, and uh, the defensive was very, very uh, good. Also, but just that he used to uh, lose some cheap, cheap, cheap balls, but all the same, he was able to defend very well, and he's, uh, he was rated seven. Okay, uh, that's seven uh, out of ten. Okay. So if you do it hundred, that will also be like seventy uh, percent. Okay. So another player who did very well also is uh, Kunedu Yadom of Hasofuka. Kunedu Yadom pull Ghana level with his goal. Aside from scoring the uh, scoring, you know the Hasofuka man was uh, very very influential at the back and he delivered very well. But just that uh, the first half he was a little bit shaky, but they after the goal and the second half started he came in stronger and did very very well and also uh, it was nice to see them playing together and doing everything uh, possible for ghana to get that very win okay so the next person is uh solomon who paired with uh 
Grand Yadom for the back there was very best and also he did his best at the first half and the second it was very, very good. You know, it's just that uh, the first half, the stamina was very poor and anticipation was not all that encouraged. But second half, he came in and did his best. So he was rated seven. Okay, that is six. He rated six. And uh, then uh, then his Corsa of House of Folk also did very, very, very well. You know, Corsa had a good outing down the left side. He combined well with uh, Jonah Tukwe and kept the team on up front foot with his forward passes yeah actually uh this game he, he did very well in that very game so he tried his best to always push uh the attackers front and also his crosses were on point the other player that was rated higher and that is seven he was just seven is dominic in so Bila, no uh dominic so Bila did his uh best and line play make that job to near perfection okay although he struggled defensively and the decision making on the ball help ghana control the game so he did very very well. and now the man of the match is uh david abagana abagana he played for rtu he's also good a player i know david abagana was the star performer he was awarded the man of the match at the end of the game abagana was superb in the offensive area he was uh press uh, resistant he progressed the ball well and his passing range was outstanding and also was astonished okay he came close uh scoring but he is bearing effort uh from a tight angle strict the wood worked as a bond park or ball but as india is italy uh, near 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 his court okay and another player is simbasta okay so, uh, simba 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 was uh was average he rated six okay but his performance was uh average and not by standard no because he's he's one of the best uh local players that we have here okay he had a good first half but switch off in the second half and got sub off in the 83rd minute okay then a free bunny had 7.5 ratings you know bunny score a goal the opener true that is a uh, very cool that didn't score opener though he, he scored the second goal through a spot kick and he won that penalty himself but hey, unlike against Madagascar, bunny was uh, able to get the goal but unfortunately he see uh, the red card that sent me off so Bania got the red card the Jonah Atuki uh read, was rated six yeah Atuki also had six uh ratings uh, there okay I don't know why I said I'm Fabiasa but he's uh ball progressing forward and keeping run yeah behind the defenders combining where the Corsa and Bania was good uh, in the first half and also the second half he came in a bit but decision making was poor yeah decision making just for him to release the ball on time he wasn't but Charlie all the same he came clean and helped the team to get then they, then the man himself the man himself Kofi Kozi Kofi Kozi you know Kofi Kozi was poor and could not establish himself in the game he sold up play decision making and touches were all poor however he gave the team on outlet with uh, good position and runs you know he had some assist to be at that the vr did not uh, <laughs> accept that goal that free bunny second goal which was root of he gave that uh, assist okay so kofi koji was rated six that's the least among the ghanaian side okay so i said he came in the second half uh to seal the win for black galaxies with uh, his last goal calm nervous charlie black galaxies won uh the game so he also rated six okay he also rated six yeah so he that was uh his original let me tell you about the sudanese side okay their goalkeeper uh aliu abdullah abu had a uh, 5.9 okay the least among uh the team you know, both ghana and uh, uh sudanese side okay and also ahmed adam had 6.6 .6, and also their captain uh nima had six, uh, 7.7 .7, and also hamza 7.1 and also Mohammed uh, Nefeg 6.7 and also Wadra Kadri 6.7 uh, Hamal Tuafo okay 6.8 he was up off though then uh Omar 6.7 uh Snyder uh, Alid over okay, 6.7 then uh, Mohammed Abdul Rahman okay Mohammed Abdul Rahman okay 7.6 then uh, also the one who got the only consolation goal for them is uh gozal noah 7.1 uh, okay so that is uh 
for the Sudanese side, those who came in for the uh, substitution, who, they, who came in, that's Awad uh, Yazid was, uh, also had 6.6. .6. He came in 28 minutes. Uh, and also, uh, you see uh, Zomola also had 6.9, came in 74 uh, minutes. Then Wahamid, 79th minute, he came in to had 6.9. Point five. So the ratings shows that Ghana dominated the game and everything was solid and perfect for the Black Galaxies of Ghana. Now Ghana is uh, waiting for the next games, but they are not going to play anymore because their last game should have been against Morocco, but Morocco is not in. So guys, this is the ratings for the Black Galaxies and the Sunadins. This is Bidding News TV. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel, hit the notification bell, see the video to your friends, like, and also comment. Let's meet another time. Bye-bye for now.